five breathers and welcome to how to train your diaphragm part three. In this video, you're going to learn some advanced techniques to increase more strength as well as more flexibility into your main breathing muscle. Now, if you haven't already watched part one and part two of this little mini series, head over to those videos first and then come back to this one. There are some contraindications for today's techniques, so if you happen to be pregnant, have any cardiac issues, any neurological issues, any recent abdominal surgeries, please stay away from these techniques today. All right, the first technique we're going to go into is diaphragmatic pumping, and this is going to be a push and pull through your abdominal wall. You'll be relaxing your diaphragm as you activate your abdominal wall, and then you're going to be engaging your diaphragm as you relax your abdominal wall. So this is going to be done on empty lungs, and when you do this on empty lungs, you're going to fill your body up with breath, empty it out, hold the breath out, and then just relax the abdominal wall to start. Ready? Take a big deep breath in. Empty it all out. Really good. So notice you can go fast, you can go slow. Just think of trying to make it manageable so when you do release the breath or when you eventually take another breath in that you're not gasping for air, you're not generating too much stress through the system. It's just a nice pleasant exploration of that connection of diaphragm. The next technique we're gonna go into is a little bit of diaphragmatic massage. So we'll do this on empty lungs and full lungs and think of just using your fingertips to crawl all the way underneath of the rib cage. All right, first one's empty lungs. Deep breath in. Let it all go. Really good. So you notice that I'm leaning away from the part that I'm kind of digging into. You can do this with both fingers at the same time. You can go opening, you can go down, you can go side to side, you can even rotate. Um, again, less is more, so start soft so it's easy, no pain whatsoever. Just a little bit of connection and exploration. And then you'll just do the same thing with full lungs. Big breath in. Awesome. I hope that these tips and tricks bring you a little bit more diaphragmatic connection and control, strength and flexibility, and ultimately an overall increased lung capacity and more efficiency through the way your body uses oxygen. If you have any questions whatsoever, put them in the comments below. And if you're not a breather yet, make sure you go to breathguidance.com, leave your email address in the get notified box, and that way you'll be able to get breath bonuses just like this into your email box every single Monday. It's a pleasure sharing these with you. I'm Danny May, and I hope to share more with you soon. Bye.